Here's how I redid my PCV system after the 034 Motorsport kit just did not work out. Their adapter was much too loose fitting in the port and was not going to seal, so I scrapped that. I got the integrated engineering piece, which fits much better, but honestly it's not perfect either. I wish it was sitting a lot more firmly in the port in order to seal against the O-ring. Uh, but I'm hoping that the O-ring is going to do a good enough job to seal it. So coming off that is a 90 degree hose end into this hose which terminates into another 90 into this T. Also coming into this T from the valve cover is the integrated engineering valve cover breather into a Fragola T and the Fragola T was the only one that I could find that was available to ship right away with the integrated female socket there otherwise the T would have been pushed way out to the right and I wanted to keep the T as close to the valve cover as possible. So that comes into this T as well. Adapted to that T are some AN to NPT fittings. And the NPT was necessary because I got this PCV valve which comes out of a Mitsubishi 3 liter turbo. And it threads in. Which is then terminated by this hose which recirculates to the intake manifold. So that's how I redid the PCV. I wanted to keep everything as stock as possible in terms of the routing, which is why I rerouted everything into the hockey puck as well. Off of there is a 45 into some more AN hose into a 5 16 to 3 quarter inch adapter because AN 10 is closer to 5 16 and the hockey puck inlet which you can see down there next to that silver hose clamp the hockey puck the hockey puck inlet is three quarters inch so I had to use that adapter along with a three quarter inch 45 degree rubber elbow all this and as you can see I have this whole side torn up as well because I did the timing belt, water pump, etc. I wanted to get it all knocked out at the same time. And the timing belt was a bit of a bitch. The hardest part was getting the timing belt back on. But once I figured out how to do that I got it all timed up and I'm confident everything will go well. Now it's time to put this all back together and hopefully that port adapter down there seals and the car runs good.